We haven't been practicing six weeks for nothing, okay? We've got to do this and we've got to do it right, okay? So let's get to it. Okay. We all ready? We're all ready? Okay. All right. On my count. All right. Oh, man. That felt good. Whew. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be composing a piece, a wonderful, wonderful piece. We're going to be using it to, you know, create another piece um, better than Mozart? Likely. Better than Beethoven? Yes. Better than... So let's get into it. Huh? No. Naturally. But you should always study the pieces that everybody knows and enjoys. So, I grabbed a few pieces. And we'll go over exactly what each piece means to us and how we can reflect upon it in making our own composition. To start, we have Four Seasons, Winter, Vivaldi. No copyright, of course. Fringe, Garbage builds into something maybe not really no I'm not no oh. it's so bad why even do this garbage because it's not entertaining the solo is not fire it's just not Got him. Next up, we have Beethoven's Moonlight Sonata. You know, quite popular, written in, uh, who knows, who really cares? The facts aren't that important. But I do know that the uh, first movement in C-sharp minor is written in the approximate truncated sonata form. The movement opens with an octave in the left hand and a triple in the figuration of the right. A melody that Hector Berlois called limitation goes to the by the right hand and is played by the accompanying ostinato triplet rhythm simultaneously played by the right hand. The movement is played pianissimo very quietly and it's loud as it goes mezzo forte or moderately loud. I do know that. I could do better if I tried. I've never really put my mind to it, but I could come up with the triplets. I mean, come on, not that hard. I wish it just had that little peak. I'm sure there's, there's like a third in there, or like a seventh, or like a fourth. I bet there's like an eighth in there. Probably like a fifth. I'd imagine a bunch of ifs super good thirds are pretty good too um actually plus the uhs let's move on we have canon and d a classic a true emotion builder one that takes you beyond where you ever thought you could ever be it makes you want to march out into the field to grab your diploma it makes you want to lie down for your final time. And it makes you want to grab the person you love by the hand and kiss them on the cheek because you're not married yet. And that's just wrong. Virgin till marriage. How it was intended. <laughs> One thing I do have to say about this piece, a little tacky, you know, overplayed. Not unlike Beyonce's All I Want for Christmas is You. Uh, is that Beyonce? Mariah Carey's All I Want for Christmas is You. All right, next we have Box. Cello Suite, 
number one. It's like fast, yet also not fast. Slow, but not slow. If I could use a word to describe it, I would say middle speed. I think that that best describes it. You know, not in the front, but also not in the back. You'll notice a, you know, fantastic use of the ifs and the s's. Our last piece, Ein Klein Noctumisk by Mozart Amadeus Amadeus. Okay, so today. It's important we recognize that Mozart was very young, stupid, and dumb. It's alright. You know, it's got some power. I do like that. Has power. Strong. Like... Early. Yeah. Um, it's it's strong, you know. It ha it has that power that you're looking for. I didn't put in a piece like Tchaikov. Ch 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 has got that power, but you know I left it out because I'm lazy and I didn't want to look it up. Because I I think about those things. I'm I'm very careful about that stuff. I'm very you know on that. It has like a waltz, you know, it, like a dance vibe. Like you could really get down and dirty with it. I'll be honest. I could pop and lock to that. And you know, that's pretty nice. Yeah, that's pretty rad. Yeah, you know they like it when I dance. When I get on the floor, I'm like, bad. Oh, yeah. My name is Brad. That's the end of our pieces. So let's sum it up. Cringe garbage to just garbage. It's really just, it's bad. I I hate it. Uh, why, why do we even listen to this garbage? The solo is just so, so good. I do, I love it. I honestly love it so much. Kind of gets a little deep for me. Um, I didn't realize that I... We're just going to forget about those parts because they, um, not, not for like any important reason, but I just feel like they didn't really... Let's move on to the next one. We would create some conflict among the notes. They're like, um, the bully in high school versus the other bully in high school. It's the two bullies and then they hate each other, but they're willing to team up to like beat the living crap out of Timmy because Timmy's like sucks. Like he's like smart and like intelligent and he's got a good family, and a good household. And there's so much, he's got so much potential. Stupid loser, nerd, idiot pants, got him. This is probably the most important thing. So what we're gonna do to signify importance two stars you know that stars signify importance wish on a star put a star on top of a tree the star of david actually that kind of let's not talk about that um any um the canon in these it had a little bit too much all i want for christmas vibes uh by critically acclaimed artist mariah carey like all i want for christmas is a classic it's been ingrained as a classic it's gonna be a no for me we're just gonna forget about it entirely except for the details. that's just funny our piece, by the looks of it, will be cut time, start in piano. We want it to be strong, middle speed. We definitely want some fizz and does. Triplets, horse, bass. If it does become cringe garbage, we want to hope that at least the people get just garbage out of it. Max, I want to be garbage. That's it. The one dude, you know, as we talked about, he wrote in uh, C sharp major, um, which, you know, I mean, it look it looks fun. It really does, but um, I don't, I don't know if I'm feeling it. I don't know. It's just, it's it's like uh, something about it just doesn't really grab a hold of me. I like, um, I like F. Let's get to writing. We'll start right on the note. Just like that. I, I can already tell that that's fire. And then what do we do? Okay, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Don't call me a genius, but I, I do know what to do. Bum 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 you see where we're going we're going up and then and then we go down we've built up so so much we've gone so high we have so much power so much strength and we're gonna come crashing down this this is this is kind of where things get crazy okay this is where we're at this is where we're at so everybody calm down take a take a breather this is where we're at right now we're about to go crazy and I want everyone to be prepared for that. Go back to the triplets. 
Then we go back up. We built up to this high point. We're going down again. And you're going to listen to this and it might inv invoke some emotion. But I want you to know that's normal. That's okay. No one's going to judge you. This is a safe place. We've got everything down. We've got middle speed. Our tempo is 100 for a cut time. That's pretty good. Fantastic use of those answers. We have so much power so much strength well paced like i said the 100 a nice pace we've got the cut time there are triplets it's on a piano which is just so important to us and if it is cringe garbage at first if you think it is at first just give it a second because at the very least i bet once you listen to it you'll realize it's not cringe garbage it's just garbage so while everyone gets ready all the audience come in come in come in as we pull the curtains open the orchestra is ready we are ready to go ready to start so let's get into it right about now the beginning the the beginning you know you don't expect it you just it just hits you it just it oh my gosh it just it, it attacks your mind it attacks your ears which is this this awful sound it, but like it gives it to you anyway and i love that oh that doesn't work that doesn't work at all did you hear that who asked for that who asked for th the spicy pineapple pizza who, where did that come from what chili peppers pineapple chocolate and avocado that's weird but maybe delicious probably not we're serving to you, it to you and you're going to eat it that's like that just means something you know you're politely taking the food eating it you're eating the squid that you got from a homeless family who lives by the shore and you're eating it out of respect and you're realizing you maybe like it or maybe you just can't smell or taste it anymore because you've been smoking too long that's what that sound is and then hit us with the classic Ooh, but with a twist? Whoever asked for the triplets, nobody did. And that's that's where the thinking comes in. Nobody thought about the triplets. People slept on the triplets. They were like, what is a triplet doing here that's not only too complicated for children, but it doesn't sound good. But that's where I say you're wrong. Because if, if you have enough that doesn't sound good, you'll have a lot more that sounds really good in comparison Ooh, i mean just you you hear the melody you hear the melody and then you get to this part you're like what is that give me back the melody there it is there it is let me give you the melody so that you can listen to this again hate it ask for it back and be relieved once i give it back to you that's the tension that music that musicians are are looking for do i think i did well Yes, I do. Do I think I could have done better? Not even for a second. Do I think that there could be a better piece in the world than Lachette D's Nuts L Wagon? Ah, that felt good. Now let me just get out of this really quickly. Uh, is this the right one? Yeah, it is. Oh, man. Ah, what a, just honestly so good. I'm just, I'm just really good. 